What's up guys? So today I'm doing a slightly different video, something a little bit more informative other than just me eating food. So as you can see behind me, I'm in a gym. This is my gym, I own the place. And uh, as per government guidelines, when we're due to reopen, hopefully in July, they are possibly going to be stipulating that everyone wears a mask like this. Now, this is the proper uh, medical mask. This has all the correct uh, micro filters in it to stop the spread of germs, etc., etc. What they're used for, basically, not just a cut off of somebody's curtains that people are selling online to make a quick buck. Uh, unless you're selling them for charity, of course, and you're giving all your proceeds to charity, that's fine. But there's plenty of people out there trying to uh, make a small living off selling just bits of cloth, which don't actually do anything. Anyway, enough about that. So today, I'm going to actually put to the test if you can have a real, and I'm talking a real workout, whilst wearing a mask. Now, they're saying that when you're actually breathing heavy, recovering from your set, etc., etc., you can pull it down. Okay. Everyone who actually trains knows those big sets when you're at the bottom and you're coming up, etc. When you breathe out and you, you exhale fast, that's when the spit and the particles come out. Okay. It's just part and parcel of the training. It is what it is. So with the mask pulled down, that's irrelevant anyway. I don't actually see why people would be wearing these in the gym. I don't see it as beneficial. So I'm gonna go through one of my tough leg workouts today. If this is the first time watching a training video, it's not gonna be uh, all training. Um, I'm just gonna basically do some sets, I'm gonna wear the mask, and I'm gonna see how I recover, and if it's actually possible to wear one. So now it's time to do a set, our main set with a mask on, and see if I can even breathe. Feels very claustrophobic, especially when you're taking deep breaths. So you can see, when I start breathing heavy, if I turn to the side, you see this? The way it's coming in, my mouth is fully open. I'm not sucking. I'm not got a closed lip. Just covering the nose. That's with the nose. Whew, that is tough. So I'm going to use this for my next set, I'm doing a Cybex hack squat now. Um, I'm already a little bit out of breath, I've done about 50 reps already, staggering the weight up. This isn't going to be my main set, but on my main set I really want to concentrate on being able to breathe and not worrying about anything restricting my face. I think that's another problem people are going to have to deal with is that you've got something across your face, you know, when you're really struggling, really trying to gasp in that air for your last final reps. So uh, I'm gonna film this one just because it's gonna get my heart rate going, it's gonna get me breathing heavy. And that should be good enough to see if uh, this is actually wearable during a heavy set. As you can see, second rep kind of slid a little bit. I sort of blew out and it, it blew it off a little bit. And uh, 
that kind of threw my concentration trying to pull it back on and by the end of it I was seeing uh, some little uh, little black patches around my eyes so uh, it's a no again on that exercise leg press test <sighs> So then guys, that is the review done. My personal thoughts on wearing a mask in the gym. And I just wanna make a point clear. You know, if the government say that they must be worn in order for gyms to open, then it is a rule that I will, of course, be upholding. Um, these are just my personal thoughts on wearing a mask. Just my personal review, just a little bit of fun. Something I thought I'd do just to throw a little bit of extra content out there and a bit, a bit of gym related. Uh, informative content so um, if your gym gives you the option try it make your own decisions before you enter the gym and uh, decide to wear a mask or not to wear a mask that just about sums up today's video thanks for watching I'll see you next time